Okay, and now there is this my seat. And then when I am planning to take that out, I need to look in that front area. And there is in two sides, there is this coverings, plastic covers, and we need flathead screwdriver. And then I only bend in that way this cover out. This is normal way in like Toyota cars. And there we can see that there is bolt and it is 14, 1, 4 millimeter bolt for fits in here and then these bolts are quite tight remember and I need a little bit longer tool and in that direction I can open and then a little bit rotation and there is really four bolts that they are very durable high quality special bolts and then next bolt we have in there a little bit is far away in that area and there is this my screwdriver and remember that we can move that our bench seat and now when I a little bit move that in here there is again same same bolt and there is really four bolts and now and now I open it next bolt okay then I can use my finger. Okay, and there is similar bolt. And then, when this first first bolts are free, this car moves. And then we go to look in this back areas in here. These bolts next. Okay, and now we are in this back seat area. And there is this our front seat in just in up. And now we are looking those uh, rear areas, those bolts. And again, I need flathead screwdriver and a little bit bend. And there is this next bolt. It is in. It's in there. And again, same bolt side. Okay, now bolt opens and then I can rotate that. Good. And soon this bolt is free. There is this my bolt similar. And then we have next bolt. It is in there. Again, I use my screwdriver and I bend that cover. I bent the cover a little bit in here. And now this bolt is in the side area. And then I insert my tool in there. And open that bolt. And it is in here. Okay, good. Then, then I will take this bolt away. Okay, good. Okay, now all bolts are free. And then we can go to this seat, this front area. Okay, and now when all bolts are free, now this door is movable and it moves like in that way. And then we have final step is that we need to unconnect this air pack and also this heater cables. And there is this, now I have only in here this heater and there is idea that I press that my, this side area in here and then I pull out this cable. Okay, now I use my screwdriver that I press in here, this down, and then now this, now this joint, and then there's, okay, this was all, and now this, my seat is fine, and then I can lift that seat out, so that I take 
my hands here. And I only carefully I move that my seat in. Okay, good. Okay, hello. And then I am planning to show you that how we can disassemble this car seat. And here I have this Toyota Camry seat, but it's very high quality seat. And, and I, I like to also show that how this seat's heating, heating system works or cooling system. And then we can check that what is wrong in this my, my seat because my heater is not working anymore. Okay, but let's go to look that how I can disassemble that. And this is also suitable information if I like to replace like new covers and those liters and seat materials in here. Okay, and then we continue. Okay, and I start this my job so that I take first this plastic covers out and for that job we need Philips crosshead screwdrivers and in Toyota cars there is these uh, screws what are those small there is one screw that looks like that crosshead screws and I need to open all of these screws first and then I can take this these covers out in that way these plastic covers this is my first job and in here when we look in that area in, in here we can see that now we have metallic parts in here and first step is to mostly open these screws away that we can get space in here and then when I have take those all of these covers out then we can go to look this soft material things and now I I take all screws and those panels out next okay and then if there is any adjusting bolts we can carefully lift if we have lat head screwdriver we can lift this out and like in here there is this locking system and, and there we can see that there is next bolt what I need to open and that there is this this panel what I need to next next remove here it could and then I continue okay and then the side panel opening is so that I need to pull out that in here in that way and then that area in another direction and then this this there is lock in that way and then this my joint opens and I can open this that area in this way and then in this Toyota car there is really interesting that there is really this opening joint this is really interesting I have not ever seen in many cars that kind of thing that I can insert my hand and this is really original and now we have more this material open in here and similar joint is in here down area. yes this Toyota they have made excellent excellent job because because now we have this mattress is in there open good and then also we can see that that Toyota, they are really using chain in this seat. Look, there's chain, and then when I have this adjusting knob, I can move that my seat in that way. Excellent. Okay, and then next part we are in here pillow area. There is this bolts, what is size is 12 millimeter, and I have this socket and next part is to take this bolts out and then we can take this metallic parts more away there is that side of bolt in here and then in this down area there's similar bolt in here 
and the, I take also that bolt away. Okay, good. And then I take also in here when we have this cover. I carefully, I carefully, I take this part away in here, and then this parts that, that we can see this inner area. Okay, and then we continue. Okay, and now when I open these bolts in here, now this front part is movable, but there is bolt, two bolts left and 12 millimeters, and I open also these bolts in there, that bolts in there. Okay, and there is similar bolt in here, and then I open also the other side. There is similar bolt there. I open also this bolt. Okay, good. And there is that bolt is free. Well, now I believe that this this front in this part can be free, yes. Now this part is really it is really free. And then then I need to only unconnect this cable connector in here so that I press this this I have screwdriver and that area then I pull out this okay and now I have this my front area is free and then we can go to look that what this looks like metallic area there is this metallic support frames and there is seat belt in here and in that another, another area we have those adjusting bolts where we can adjust this, like this seat's position or then this seat height until the system works. Okay, in interesting. And there is this, look how this part moves and I rotate this. Okay, and then especially this chain movement, this is really fantastic. I have not ever seen any chain system in any seat. This is quality. Okay, good. And then we can continue. Okay, and then when I like to take this seat cover out in here, and I like to see those inner parts, then we have to open. There is some of those joint in here, and for that purpose, we need this high quality tongs that we can open this metallic these joints. They looks like that. And then in turn this another area. In here also high quality tongs and everything is is easy. And then we look and then I open also that part. And in here we have also this same metallic these things and we need to install this back good and now when we look this is quite nicely and then there is this side front side area there is the small metallic plates that I have to rotate in that way, using my toes. This Toyota quality is so excellent that it is so easy to disassemble and so easy to assemble. It is Toyota's motto. Okay, and then 
then I take these parts that way and then I can take this cover I can take this cover out In that way and then, then I can take this cover more out Okay, and then I have to be a little bit carefully. I have to be a little bit carefully because there is this electric heater that I don't damage this heater. And there is then there is some joints in there. But now there is metallic mattress and in some cars these springs are broken so we can replace those but in this Toyota car they are they always is fine all parts are fine and then then this my letter when we look at how I can take this carefully there is this joints in here and I need again my tongs here there is small toast joint and maybe there is that support thing this metallic thing and I, I need to now open this all all this metallic joints in here this metallic joints that I can carefully and if I have tongs I carefully I cut these parts and I work a little bit in here and then we can look in inner area okay and then I show that what I am doing I have in here these tongs and then when I a little bit move that area there is this metallic joints in here and I cut this all of those in that way and then this my my this, my this part opens there is one left one in here final one in that area Okay, cool. And now it's free. Now it's free. And now I can lift that my cover out. And then I can also look that why this my heated seat is bad. Because it is in it is in like in bad position. It should be in here in that way. But it was in badly and then because this is not working or actually if it is in that kind of position I understand that why it is not working and then then I like to test test that that is this that is this my Toyota heated seed material what is like cotton and there is this metallic wire and cable goes through and there are those sensors what stops this heating when there is too hot and now I like to check that there is there is those cables and there is three cables in there three cables and then there is this is like plus and minus and this goes like this outer heated seat area and that means that those brown and white is this testing 
parts and I will take my tester next. Okay, and then I like to show that how I am working with this upper area of this seed element. And there is the same area that in lower one. And there we can see those similar mattress elements and same idea that how I can take this cover out. Okay, that kind of information and thank you for watching and have a nice day to you.